Let's learn how to use the product function in Google Spreadsheets and find out total sales for each items given in this data table. In given data, first column shows name of items, book, pen, stapler, bag, gift wraps, pins, notebook, glitters, pencil, eraser. In given data, second column shows units sold per item, for example 20 units of book were sold, 40 units of pen were sold, 35 units of staplers were sold, 30 units of bags were sold. In given data, third column shows selling price per unit of the items, for example, each unit of book was sold for $2, each unit of pen was sold for $3. Each unit of stapler was sold for $1, each unit of bag was sold for $4. We have to find product of units sold from column C and selling price per unit from column D to find total sales of each item in the column E. We can find using traditional way by just multiplying units sold and selling price per unit. This can be done by multiplying cell C3 and cell D3 which would multiply 20 units with $2 per unit value and return a product value of $40 in total sales of books. Now simply use autofill handle to drag down and apply same formula to the cells below. This will give total sales value for each item using the formula of multiplication we applied earlier. We could also use the built-in product function in Google Spreadsheet to get the same values. We have to type in equal sign followed by product, followed by parenthesis, it is now asking for factors to multiply or values to conduct the product function. We want to apply product function for units sold and selling price per unit. So, in parenthesis we enter cell C3, then add comma and enter or select cell D3. His will apply product function to 20 units and $2 per unit, returning a value of $40 in total sales of books. Now simply use autofill handle to drag down and apply same formula to the cells below. This will give total sales value for each item using the product we applied earlier. The column E shows total sales for each item calculated using product function in Google Spreadsheets. This is a basic example and the same function can be used for multiple other complex calculations using Google Sheets. Thank you.